What's up, peeps? It's a terraformer, and let's hope this doesn't crash again. Um, so during this abnormally long cutscene, I'll be explaining where what's been going on. The first time I went through that, it took a pretty long time. What is this but a game I found today? So anyway, I, where I've been, I've been working six days a week, ten hours, so all I've been doing is sleeping and working. And as you can see, the, the jump button is up. So of course my pet peeve odometer has reacted as such, but I have a cough 360 controller on cough, so I don't have to worry about all that. So yeah, I, I got sick too, so every day I was a zombie, and then once I got sick, I was a zombie with flu. Okay, so let's play, as you can see, you can play this online. I'm guessing it's online co-op. I'm hoping it's online co-op. So, yeah, if anyone wants to play this thing, that'd be pretty cool. So, you got these four people. I gotta join. Um, yeah, I'm gonna pick the dude with the monocle, because, you know, monocles, pretty cool things to have going on. As you can see, this is a Meat Boy clone. And it auto-saves also, that's nice, uh, there, yes, <laughs> it's good to play a Meat Boy clone without actually having played Meat Boy, so yeah, I went through the first two levels, it also started me with a different character, because that's who I picked the first time around, so yeah, I forgot that guy was even there, he kind of blends in a little bit, but that's your, that's your basic thwomp, that's a muncher right there, you can like duck and also jump with the up button if you press it, the graphics are somewhat SMW inspired also, there's a, there's a jump in the air type maneuver, it's pretty awesome, sometimes these things have spikes, or as I've seen in trailers, or video form, or whatever it was, yeah, that you're ducking now, okay, but you're still the wrong character. Bug, obviously, I detected it. Oh, there they are. I didn't know they already would appear in the, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> in the first level. What's up with the, with the cutoff there? I don't, I don't really know. We experienced that in the, in the second level, and I'm dead again. I, I'm doing pretty, pretty rad. The music is pretty rad also. It reminds me of, and uh, I keep repeatedly head first into make blood everywhere, but it's because I haven't played this part yet. Oh man, th this like starts out pretty pretty trickily, and like I'm not completely confident with the control scheme or the 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 the, the floatiness of the the thing going on, the jumping. Hooray! I wish I could make it up there so I didn't have to do scary jump. It's just edge jumps, man. It's not that bad. Oh, I mistimed that a little bit, didn't I? Okay. So let's let's wait until it's about to leave and I just barely made that. Okay. So Honestly, the jump kind of reminds me of Jill the Jungle. It's pretty precise, and, like, it's not very loose like SMW is. It's more tight. You'll go and you stop when things are going on. Like, it, oh crap, I went too close to him. I wanted to d explain what the hell I meant by, like... Like, it's like Mega Man also, where you, you stop pressing the button, as soon as you stop pressing it, you will drop right down. Like, cut off, man! That's terrible! This game should get a 10 out of 10 due to obvious copyright infringement. <laughs> okay, so we're not only playing Meat Boy, but we're playing, um, that one game. Oh man, I found a secret! I am the most clever... Um, okay, I can do that. I'm experienced in, in light jumps. Holy crap. Uh, what do you do here? So, cut off sometimes means secrets, and I'm fine with that. But, um, yes, better jump person me. Okay. 
Okay, it's gonna be a little harder since it is the secret path after all. And I can stand on riding the thwomps, and I can also see where they're about to shoot. So that that's pretty nice of it. Uh, this is this is really neat and fun. And I I'm liking it, but maybe it's like all the 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 meat boy stuff. That's is that even a jump I can make? Oh, because I have to do that. I forgot about you. You taught me that earlier, and I jumped right into that. That that's pretty spectacular. I can go a little bit into the fire and be scared a whole lot all the time. I didn't mean to do that. Well, at least it's less prevalent than in Amapani, which- oh. I had to duck there. I forgot I have more controls than just the jump button, the right and the left keys. It's pretty, pretty spectacular, because that's gonna shoot right the freaking way. <laughs> Oh man, this is pretty pretty intense and fun. Probably gonna swap between characters if I have the opportunity, just to give everyone their fair shake at screen time. Okay, so I don't wanna... Oh man, this is a jump. It's like it's been on screen the whole time, I just didn't, like, notice it. But it, it wasn't too bad. And there, there's blood everywhere. That's why it's bloody, because you make a bloody mess and... Wow. Wow. What? Can I slide duck? Um... Yes, I can. Okay. Okay, we're learning things. I can go backwards, too, but... Okay. This is, like, very open-ended, and he did a thing when I left him alone, but I already did that, so I don't remember if that happened already on screen, and I showed it off, and... Wow, that is something. Can I jump? No. Whoa. This difficulty curvature is existing. Okay, there we go. Awesome. So I got a choice here. One looks a little harder, so I'm going to go for that. Yes, that that was an interesting idea. That What? It, it, it didn't lead to anything. That's so jerkish. You made me do a jump. Maybe that's where another path ends up, you, or something. I, I didn't take all the paths, but I'm gonna try to retake them and recreate this jump I made earlier, and voila. You see, it's the hardest part is learning what the heck to do, and learning how the heck I'm gonna edit these things, because, you know, you resume pretty quickly. What? That, that was nice of you to, to inform me that was gonna happen, but that's because I was, like, not taking my time and stuff. Oh, crap. Yeah, I was going right into that, even though, like, the controls dictate that I could do stuff better, but that's okay. I, I, it doesn't, wow, okay, uh, no, oh, I have to do better on the trampoline. It's SMB3 more or less, or less is more, or it, it's not SMB where SMW, Okay. Alright, no, you just don't press anything at all. Okay, then. I'll, I'll do that. Yes. <laughs> okay. I don't know how much I'm going to be playing, because uh, this is just kind of going, and time is happening and existing all the time. I, I can't double jump. Maybe I get a double jump at some point. I don't know. I, I'm not sure how to make jumps like this, which are probably relatively simple in the scheme of things, considering what we're doing in the first world. Oh... Uh, this, this map is going to be filled with blood, okay? Can I make it? No. What? There we go, but I still have to make another jump. I thought I messed up. There's spikes up there. What? What's the reasoning? And you can duck mid-air? What is this, SMBX? Really? Okay, well, that's gonna be utilized, I'm sure, because this game is probably like that in some fashion. I didn't know it was gonna hit me there, because I wasn't quite sure what's going on. But that's a usual thing for making videos, right, everyone? 
I got a duck here. Flaming lava, it's going on. Why do I keep thinking I can do that? That's the second time I've died that in that exact way. I can't rush this. I cannot rush this. It's okay, you know, I just... What? Okay. That's that's what happened. Gotta remember that that happens. It's the Amapani kill. And but I didn't die, so it, it just it, it just so happened to be. I don't think I can make that jump. I don't think I should try because I'll probably end up dying, not noticing or paying attention what else was going on in the vicinity. Arn. Whoa. Okay then. Okay, so it wants me to just kind of drop down. It's not really that hard. That jump was a little strange. I'm gonna have to, like, do that, and then die. <laughs> yep, you can just make it inside of there. There we go! Okay, now just wait until the safe opportunity comes. I wonder if I should complete this world, and I'm not sure exactly where I am in the world. We got also Potaboo's intense. Um, okay, so I'll jump now. Kinda was only paying attention to the Potaboo, so that's kind of a problem. Oh crap. Ah, oh, that blends in. I don't know how to get up there either, unless it's like an entrance for another level, because this game seems to have plenty of paths going on. Why did I jump? There, I can just... No, I can't just... Duck, or... No, it wouldn't have worked. Okay, yes. Just get on one platform and I'll be alright. There's a spiky there. There's a spiky there also. Okay, there we go. Beaten the level. Is there gonna be a boss? Not quite... Sure, or did I make it to the to the cave that also looks like uh as they traveled through the plains they came upon a tail tall mountain pass. Oh yeah, there was a cutscene like before the first level and I kinda skipped it because I didn't think it would auto save like that. So I'm sorry. Uh, buy the game for yourself. It's only ten dollars, so and then you'll get to see the, the cutscene. And it's gonna be on Steam soon anyway, so but you can like transfer C D codes and stuff. I'm going back. The planes I got a secret exit to collect. Meet you back there or it's gonna start me right at the level where the secret exit exists. But I don't seem to have the power to get up there. Oh! Oh, okay, I do have the, the possibility of getting up there, I just have no idea how to. Darn, this is insane. I don't know what you want from me, but it's pretty freaking insane. And that's no surprise here, it is happening and also existing! Darn, I got stuck in a hole. I don't know, like, exactly what is, like, going on or how I'm supposed to solve this problem. Because he seems to stop momentum once I double jump or something. Yeah, he just kind of hops in the air, so I gotta, like, get over and then do that. It's probably because I'm pressing down. Wow, I have no idea. There we go, but... But... But no, what the heck? Okay, so I'm back here, but I don't know how to do, like, anything. A crazy, weird jump, like... Huh? But, but why? Man, that's, that's really lame, I thought I was onto something. But... I wasn't. I think I'm gonna leave it here, because I, I kind of have no idea, and I've been bashing my head against things, and so how did this go? Oh, okay, so I I still don't completely understand, but it's alright, it, it's, it's okay. So yeah, that goes just to there, but then I did the side path. 
it would seem like I could do that, but I, I don't know. I feel bashing myself head first into collisions is something that is not always the best thing to do. So, if someone wants to explain to me what the hell to do there, feel free, but I'm ending it here. See you guys next time, probably next week.